welcome myself MD Mahmoudul Hassan, Assistant Professor at Department of Geoinformation Science and Earth Observation, Patuagali Science and Technology University, Bangladesh. We have discussed so far one key drivers of climate change, our population and demographic structure, economic growth, individual income and lifestyle. Nature of urban system, urban form and design, and geographical location. Now we just need to know what sorts of structure, functions and forms are affected by climate change in the urban areas. After this video, you will be able to explain the effects of climate change on cities. Climate-induced vulnerabilities in the cities may include unavailable drinking water, health impacts, severe and intensive extreme events, that is flood, cyclone, storm surge, hydro etc. These vulnerabilities can be extended or triggered based on the agglomeration of people, urban activities, and infrastructure. Effects of extreme weather events. Cities are extremely susceptible to natural disaster, which are predicted to occur frequently as a result of climate change. Cities are becoming dangerous and some cases larger or both because of upward urban population growth. These upward trends make cities more vulnerable to any kinds of extreme events. Total 530 cities comprising 517 million people around the world reported as vulnerable to climate hazards in 2018. Current exposure to extreme weather events including urban flood, cyclone, tidal surge will be doubled by 2050. In Asia, Nearly all cities are susceptible to multiple natural hazards. Super Typhoon Haiyan and associated storm surge cost 13 billion US dollar in China's coastal cities. Mumbai flood cost 100 million US dollar in 2005. In Hanoi, about 20,000 households affected and 45,000 hectare secondary crops damaged in 2008 flood. Total estimated loss was 1.6 million US dollar. In addition, flood have struck 3 to 9 times more frequently than they did 5 decades ago in 8 coastal states in the United States and cost 14.1 million US dollar between 2005 and 2017. Sea level rise is the result of climate change, which has several direct and indirect effects. Direct effects include changes coastline, coastal flooding, coastal erosion, disrupt and damage natural ecosystem and coastal infrastructure, displacement, salt water intrusion, high storm surge during cyclone, including increasing coastal groundwater table, etc. And possible direct effects include since the property of soil, functions of ecosystem, economic activities of coastal dealers, psychological effects, recreational effects, etc. About 65% of coastal cities with more than 5 million populations are located in low-lying areas or along coast having huge human populations and are half of the national economic activities including trade and commerce are highly vulnerable to sea level rise and is associated inundation, high storm surge, erosion, etc. Effects on temperature. Climate change is expected to reduce heating demand during winter while increasing cooling demand in summer. However, the magnitude of such effect is significantly influenced by the geographical location. Climate change is almost 
certain linked to a rise in the intensity of heat waves. Rising temperature can lead to discomfort, monetary disruption, displacement, and higher death rates. Heat waves reportedly caused a raise in fatality and casualty in Europe and North America. However, also associated with age, location, and socioeconomic conditions. Another example, industrial development and economic prosperity of Brazil is significantly depending on hydropower, which is highly vulnerable to changing pattern of precipitation. Heat waves hit much of Europe in the summer of 2003. Seasonal temperature in Portugal, France, Italy, England, and Wales are found as the hottest year on record, which caused enormous mortality rate. In all Italian capitals, mortality increased by 3,134 in 2003 during the three summer months compared to previous year. Effects on water resources. Urban water resources comprises underground water, surface water, that means inland water, sea water, and rainwater. Consequences of climate change urban heat island, flooding, cyclone, storm surge, drought, sea level rise are all having significant effects on water resources in urban areas. The effects are reduction in availability of water, both surface and groundwater, increased water demand hampered water supply system, including infrastructure and treatment, and deteriorating water quality, etc. Climate change has sustained urbanization along with population growth and intensified water uses, putting more pressure urban water sources. In addition, increases in mean air temperature would accelerate evaporation and increase water demand for cooling in buildings. Potentially drivers of total per capita water consumption. Both increasing population and mean air temperature would result to a sub substantial requirement of urban water. Drought and prolonged prayer with the precipitation would inevitably result in a reduction in the supply of potable surface water and groundwater disturbance. Such ne negative effect significantly decrease the availability of fresh water in semi-arid and arid region. For example, several areas in western USA, Mediterranean basin, northeastern Brazil, southern Africa are expected to suffer a decline in water supply. Water resources in terms of water quality in the coastal cities are vulnerable to sea level rise, induced saline water intrusion in surface water and groundwater. Reduced river flow is considered key cause of developing severe saline condition at the shore. As saline sea water eventually flows upstream. Moreover, sea water can make coastal groundwater salty for lateral or downwater infiltration. Effects on human health. Extreme heat is one of the most hazardous environmental conditions that increasing heat related death and illness in cities in many countries. Human tolls and casualties are the direct effect of severe natural calamities frequented by climate change. Total 2,039 human deaths due to heat stroke were recorded in the United States in between 1999 and 2010. An extreme heat wave killed over 70,000 people in Europe in 2003. In 2005, more than 1,000 fatalities recorded in Mumbai due to tropical cyclone that heat accompanied by 94 centimeter rainfall in 24 hours. In addition to physiological effects, psychological effects including post-traumatic depressive illness, anxiety,
complicated grieving and sadness are also observed following disaster event. Moreover, changing seasonal climatic condition, including temperature, precipitation, humidity can change the returns of vectors that might increase health illness, including diarrhea, fever, etc. Furthermore, acute famine is also resulting of extreme weather condition, which may have a significant impact on human health. The great medieval famine of Europe is an example of climate-induced severe crop shortages, food price increases, starvation, and death. Effects on urban forestry Urban trees in terms of forest can be seen in parks, along the street in rows, or even as single tree. And they must be adjacent to urban dealers and urban structures. The hydrological cycle is changing as a result of climate change. And this has an effect on urban forest. Winter precipitation increases the risk of physical damage to urban forest due to higher ice loading and snowfall. Water scarcity on the other hand are increased due to increased evapotranspiration in summer. Moreover, extreme event like cyclone, storm surge, flood may damage urban forest. For example, Hurricane Sandy, who is hit New York City in October 2012, accompanied by high speed winds and storm surge, impacted negatively on tree space and populations. Sandy up to uprooted and washed away 10,956 trees in New York City. Effects on urban tourism. Tourism is one of the fastest rising sectors in world economy, which is highly dependent on local climate and environmental conditions. Extreme events and environmental circumstances, including temperature variation, excessive or inadequate rainfall, loss of ecological habitat, infectious disease, have an effect on resource-oriented attraction of tourists. The total amount of visitors, duration of stay, the trend of recreational activities, destination of preferences, customer satisfaction, operational cost, and even standards of safety and security in tourist area are more likely to influence by the effects of climate change, both at domestic and international level. For example, coastal cities like Rio de Janeiro that are really upon based region may be affected by rising sea level combined with increased frequency and severity of destructive tidal waves. In Rio de Janeiro, coastal erosion caused by sea level rise increases operational cost. Number of tourists may decline as many cities are transforming their tourist sites because of the severe effects of flooding, heat waves, sea level, rise, storm surge. Thank you for watching this video.